Zambia has about 58% of its land suitable for agricultural production. It is blessed with fertile soils, abundant water resources and a good climate. With such resources, the country has a great potential of eradicating extreme poverty and hunger through mobilization and capacity building of farmers to adequately use the existing agricultural resources. In April 2010, development aid from people to people in Zambia started implementing the Farmers Club's program in Kapirimposhi, Mukushi, Masaiti and Chingola districts with funding from Africa Water Facility under the African Development Bank. The program organizes and trains small-scale farmers in improved gardening and the use of low-cost irrigation systems. The Farmers Club's program started with 5,000 farmers that are organized in 100 clubs. In Mkushi district in the central province of Zambia, hundreds of farmers have benefited greatly from the activities in the Farmers Club's program. The Farmers Club Mkushi started last year, in the middle of last year. We have 25 clubs across uh, Mkushi district with a membership of 50. Uh, that comes to 1,200 farmers that uh, we are overseeing in this project. This project is a small-scale irrigation project where we are promoting the use of uh, low-cost technologies in irrigation like treadle pumps, raw pumps, uh, small engine machines and the faro irrigation. The farmers are trained by GAPP staff and camp extension officers in improved farming methods to improve soil fertility, to diversify crop production and to engage in low-cost irrigation systems in order to cultivate all around the year. We always give them most especially on how to go about their food crops, the gardening crops, like the horticultural crops, as well as the on conservation farming. Each farmer's club has established a model garden with efficient irrigation systems where farmers practice the basic skills and techniques they are trained in. Besides, the farmers use the learned farming methods in their private gardens and fields in order to improve their crop yields and household income. The farmers meet regularly in study circles to discuss and establish systems for common buying of inputs and selling of produce and to make plans for production in their demonstration gardens and in their private fields and gardens. The irrigation systems farmers use to grow their crops include raw pumps, treadle pumps, motor pumps and flood irrigation. The use of improved farming methods and irrigation systems among the farmers has worked well with many of them attesting food self-sufficiency and improved income in their households. So through our farmers club, Navadapu, we have a partnership with our citizens to introduce some loan. So if we have a loan, in a particular loan, we have 2 million inputs, 2 million. Umwali fertilizer, umwali intambo, umwali nama chemicals. Pali hii tu milio, nituwaisa nituwaisa linaliri mabuino sana, no usombo shiba alifia buino sana. Nukulipatu waisa lipila within five months instead of six months. Ayanguka, elio naka prove chindesu hilo kwe watina nguelo ngambi lo kabo mfia kama shinimbo naka lo ufili kunita nshinka chilapo. Pantu ndino kulima hapa kulu kuchilefe na leli makali. So ka prove chikalifia buino. Eo na kuunga ndaku inendemo na kwa chaka wika lokale iba kwa kari kwa at least akari kwa pamulu. Na tu kwa tako tu ashita kwa naka TV, filia, no tu afro. Kwa pampu kutapirisha gardeni na ya fwa sana pantu kuchira ukuimbe fishime fingi mugardeni. No mba opu tule wamsha rogu pampu na chafu pantu le kwa tafe ichishi machimo. Elo tule don za meishi kukwala mugardeni yesu. Development aid from people to people in Zambia connects the farmers to a microfinance institution called Christian Enterprise Trust of Zambia, CETISAM, in order to support the farmers in getting small cash loans for low-cost irrigation and other agricultural inputs. The Christian Enterprise Trust of Zambia, through its loan officers, offers lessons to farmers in loan management for them to efficiently repay the loans to the institution. So far, we've given about 183 farmers an excess of 125 million kwacha. And the repayment rate so far is very good. Only a few lapses here and there, but the repayment is really good as of now.
Development aid from people to people in Zambia works with the Ministry of Agriculture and Cooperatives at national, provincial and district levels in the implementation of the Farmers Club's program. Basically our role as Minister of Agriculture is that we, at a district level we have a, a, a committee which is spearheading this, which I'm part of it as district agriculture coordinator. The senior agriculture coordinator is part of it, the irrigation engineer is also part of it, including the, the crops officer. At field level, our extension staff, who are the campo extension officer, they are the frontline staff who are actually involved in the technical aspect of ensuring that the, the farmers club activities are implemented which includes conservation farming also we are in, into vegetable production and farmers club's program has a great potential to improve the livelihood and income for small-scale farmers in zambia Equipped with knowledge and skills, farmers have the ability to improve their food production and income and to thereby free themselves from the shackles of extreme poverty and hunger.